Yeah, they're the ones that gave me that outfit, you know, and I was supposed to be wearing it right now, but someone dropped the ball. Oh, I, I was supposed to text Brittany after Jared accidentally shot. Oh my gosh. The best part is he owns this outfit, but we live in Utah. <laughs> it looks good though, and it looks amazing right here, guys. This is like the most beautiful backdrop. We have white sandy beaches, turquoise, crystal clear water in the background. It is beautiful here. So Judd and Lynn's are actually out here for a work trip for Justin. Justin's company is called Opinion. You guys should go check it out. They're out here for a client event, which is why they're here. But then they surprised us with a trip to the Bahamas. You guys, can you believe that? We are in Bimini, the Bahamas. They have planned the most incredible day. We oh, can't wait yeah. to hang out. I think we just love them. We miss oh, them so nice. much. They got us a golf cart. Guys, like we got ourselves a golf cart. It has four tires. It's got no steering. <laughs> yeah, the steering is pretty bad. <laughs> and apparently the keys are universal, so if we lose it, we can just take the key and go jump in another one. <laughs> okay, but the craziest part is that this is literally a two-hour boat ride away from where they live. Yeah. Literally two days later. Like, Here we are, guys. <laughs> oh at the my end gosh. Of North Bimini over there. To my left is South Bimini. We're at a place <laughs> called Spook Hill Beach. Now, if you're curious about the history of Spook Hill Beach, it is because it is near a cemetery. The cemetery That's true. is about 500 paces that way. That's now, true. it is said that the lost city of Atlantis is nearby on Bimini Road. Now, if you guys, Bimini Road, nobody knows what Bimini Road is. It's an <laughs> underwater stone structure. That's, That's right. Atlantis. That's now, true. That's cool. Are we going to confirm or deny that today? We don't. Yes. Know. We do have some underwater scooters. We're going to go discover some fish, some underwater license, some people, some bohemians. We're yes. Gonna have fun. It's going to be. <laughs> you. <laughs> The boys are gonna go jump in, test the water, see if the snorkeling's good right here. Yeah. Lindsay and I are gonna just sit on the beach. That's what we do best. <laughs> Seriously, and look at this gorgeous water. I can't get over how beautiful it is. So like, pretty here. It's stunning, and the clouds, there's like a few dark ones with the sun shining. Like that is like a picture. Look at them walking oh out there. these really cool underwater scooters. We have never tried anything like this out before, so it should be really cool to see how we like them, but it propels you forward, so all you do is hang on and it takes you under, which is awesome. A lot of people come over to Bimini, they stay here a few nights, there's a few different hotels and everything like that, but we decided just to come for the day because we have some other really fun plans with these guys. The remainder of the weekend, as you guys know, it is someone's birthday. 
Jared this coming Sunday. All in all, highly, highly recommend if you do want to come to Florida, this would be an awesome thing to do. Sunny day, sunny day, sunny days. No clouds in the sky, but I get away. Feels like it's been a freaking decade. Sorry, don't call me cause I'm gonna be on Sunny day, sunny day, make way. All the stress and doubt. on the underwater scooter. Oh yeah. I actually didn't know if you were gonna like it at first, but Brittany loved it. It was so fun. <laughs> Jared was literally giggling the entire time. <laughs> oh, it was awesome. It was seriously so much fun. Now we're just kind of cruising through like the one road of Bimini. You guys, they drive on the left side here. Yeah, they drive on the left side of the road here, which is just so different, so interesting, and it's really, really cool. So we're putting our life in Justin's hands, yeah. so I don't know how to feel about this. Yeah. <laughs> this water right here, you guys, is just nuts. It is so blue, so turquoise. There's just so many different shades of blue right here. It's just incredible. So one thing about this island, you guys, is it's only seven miles long and 700 feet in width at its widest point. And 1,800 population. 1,800 population, that's crazy. We are all starving. We are so hungry. It's almost three o'clock and we yeah. have not eaten. Nothing. So we've been driving along. Some of the places looked a little bit questionable. We did find, however, one that looked pretty darn cool. There was tons of like dollar bills all over the restaurant. Justin had a one dollar bill, so he signed his name and Lindsay's name on a dollar bill. Unfortunately, I didn't have any dollar bills. <laughs> so or not that we'd be willing to leave there. Yeah, we'll no, we we'll put, put it that way. Anyway, but I did write our name onto the wood. You can oh. see there's tons of names there. It was so cool. So if you guys come here to Bimini, definitely take a photo in front of that if you can spot it. Yes, you guys, and if you've been here to Bimini, let us know all the cool things, because we yes. are definitely going to be back here. Oh, 100%. For sure. It was so beautiful. Like, the ride over here was, like, just so, like, calm, relaxing. Like, the seats went back. It was just awesome. And then once you get here, the water is just insanely blue, so turquoise, very different than Fort Lauderdale. But there's also, like, just white sandy beaches. The snorkeling here is amazing. We did those underwater scooters. I was telling Brittany, we, I I think we need to do Oh my gosh, they're so yeah, awesome, I think you guys. We need to get one. They it's are so fun. So much fun. That is something we would use yeah. all the time yeah. for sure. For 100%, sure. Yeah. We decided to come here to the beautiful Hilton Hotel, you guys. This place looks insane. Oh my gosh, this place is so beautiful. So this hotel is famous for having an infinity pool on top of the roof. We are definitely gonna be checking that out here in a second. And just turn around the camera yeah. there. Look at this. You're like on this little waterway. It's I know. Reminding me of a Fort little bit of Fort Lauderdale, yeah. This is reminding us definitely a little bit of Fort Lauderdale. We have this like intercoastal waterway. It's not intercoastal, but there's definitely a waterway right here, channel. It's so pretty. Oh, it's so oh beautiful. God. Speaking of beautiful, ow! <laughs> you guys, but seriously, we can't wait. The food looks so good. We ordered yeah. some pizza, we got a cheeseburger, Ooh. we got cheesecake. Guys, we got everything, and they have tons of restaurants here too. We saw one in here earlier that's called like Tides or something like that. Yeah, and a, bar. yeah, the dining in that was like done to the T. You guys, Jared and I keep talking like we definitely need to come back here and yes. spend a couple days for sure. One hundred percent. Two hour boat ride yeah. from where we live. Like super, super close. Customs was easy. Yes, and I oh, and I totally forgot to mention. I, I'm sure a lot of you guys are wondering who's taking care of little Finny today. Our sweet friends, they're watching him for the whole day. They were so excited. Yeah. So he's in good hands, you guys. They're we're incredible. In good hands here with Jet and Lynn. And <laughs> it's just been awesome. I know far. it's been amazing. <laughs> so, babe, is this a good start to your birthday weekend? Yes, hundred percent. This is amazing. <laughs> This 
the top of the Hilton Hotel. Check this out. This is an infinity pool right here that overlooks the Bahamas. This is absolutely breathtaking. I cannot believe this right now. Wow. I think Brittany and I are gonna have to come back here, stay at this very hotel, and go swim in this pool. Wow. Okay, so when Justin first told us that we were going to Bimini, I instantly looked up fun things to do there. And one of the things that I saw online to do was go to this infinity pool. And I looked at it and I was like, oh my gosh, that looks insane. It looks like so much fun. And now here I am physically at the infinity pool looking over Bimini here in the Bahamas. I am literally standing right where it shows you online. This is incredible. This is absolutely incredible. It's just so beautiful. I cannot believe that. Look at that right there. Wow. Unreal. Well guys, we took a cruise around the entire island on the golf carts and it's crazy how small this island is, but that also adds to the epicness of this island because it is beautiful pretty much everywhere you go. Look at that right here. Look at this. Look how long that white sandy beach is with the turquoise waters. How many times have I said that already in today's video? It just like happens over and over again. This place is beautiful. I cannot believe this is our first time here in almost two years. Brittany and I are 100% going to be coming back. I mean, especially the Hilton, it was beautiful there. And the crazy thing is that we actually haven't come close to exploring everything. There is still so much more to see. Like this beach right here, we're gonna go hit up. We're gonna take the underwater scooters again and just go tour around because those scooters are seriously so much fun. What I love is that you literally, you can just park your cart right here, the golf cart, which by the way, is actually not that bad of a deal. It's $90 for the entire day. And that's basically the only form of like rental car that you can get out here. Look where we are though. Incredible. This is truly incredible. So we're gonna post up here for a little bit, take out the underwater scooters, try to go explore a little bit more of like the marine life. It looks like there's quite a bit of like snorkeling out further past beyond these buoys. But man, I know I said it once before, definitely go check us out over on Instagram, at Jared and Britt. Brittany is always getting some sick stories. was and is amazing. Justin and I went through this underwater center block tunnel, which was so much fun. We went back and forth through it. Anyways, riding those things is so much fun. I feel like we need to get them for sure. We're just gonna have to, but we are hustling right now because we got to pack up all of our stuff. Hurry, drop off the golf cart and head back to the ferry. Well guys, all good things must come to an end, and we're leaving right now. Just vlogging this. If you guys aren't following them, definitely go over and check them out, our life in Holland. <laughs> but it's been so much fun. Huge, mad shout out actually to them for writing this for us. This was amazing. Yes, you guys did do something. They got us these tickets. They provided the fun with those awesome scooters. This was awesome. The most amazing lunch. They're just so sweet and humble. They make everything about everyone else. No, you're amazing. No, you're amazing. No, you're amazing. But you guys, the fun is not over yet. No. We saw the ride back. Plus, we saw a few more days with these guys as well. Oh, baby. They're not getting rid of us yet. So you guys can probably see behind me that massive cruise ship. This is actually a cruise port for a lot of cruise ships that come through here. That's the Celebrity Line. I actually bumped into a lot of the cruise cruisers here and they were saying it's part of a seven day cruise where they go down to Cozumel, Belize and this is also one of the stops as well as Key West. Oh 